Any other comments? Yes, sir. I'd like to make a comment. You don't mind. Mayor, you're on the right track and everything. But ladies and gentlemen, let me tell you what's wrong. When I went to school, we had the Bible. My father believed in the Bible, the Christ and the Constitution. He had a second Bible that was red, white, and blue. He believed in faith, family, and everything like that. What's wrong with America? When we took prayer out of school, when we took the pledge out of school, when we took in the African American community, you had the Negro National Anthem and then the National Anthem. In the white community, you had the prayer, the pledge, and the National Anthem. When we took all that stuff out because the Supreme Court said so, we should have disobeyed right then and there. And um, if we don't turn back to God, we're going to be turned into hell. I'm, now, hold Mr. up. Mr. You said no, I got three is, minutes. No, sir, it's not. Uh, hold your, up. Your, your, your comments to... are not germane to the yes, conversation. Yes, it is. Because without turning on. back to God, we'll be turned into hell. Okay. Thank One more thing thank I you. wanted to say, too. One Mayor, quick, like quick, I said, quick. I want to thank you on all this stuff. Now, some of y'all say we couldn't pay. When my dad died of COVID-19, a Korean War vet, he didn't have much money for me. So I couldn't pay my bill. So I got a $3,600 bill. Now, I need help as a veteran okay, Mr. and stuff Mr. like White. that. I need help. Mr. White. So, so that shouldn't excuse me from getting You'll some assistance from Reese. Well, if you go through this proper process. That no, he just that said if, if, if you got more, you hadn't paid. Well, I ran out of money. Mr. White, listen, That's, I appreciate what you're saying, and I would encourage you to look at as we launch some of these plans, there's actually a thoughtful, faith-based component to all these oh, things that we're okay, going to do. Okay, well, that's good. Bear with me a second. But, yes, sir. <laughs> but there are lines we go up to with faith-based components. There are things the Supreme Court now allows in that. We are not anti, but what the council saying is not germane is you're not at the line. You hopped over it and ran down the street past it, and that's I get that. That's your faith, and it's probably shared by most of the people in the room. Maybe everyone in the room, but there are rules about it in oh, a public okay. setting. So I'm sorry. Right. I'm sorry. I know. And then the other thing is, apply for a store, follow the stuff, and don't do it in here. Nobody can grant your store application in I this room, you. and they really don't have to hear that right now because it's it's your business, and you can. Tell yeah, us but about I need your help. Business. That's Pro what I'm trying to well, tell, tell you. Tell us about it privately. What? That? That's what's wrong now. You keep everything behind closed no, doors no, and nobody no. knows anything about it. No, the, these parents is just like these parents. We need to start charging these parents. Mr. Cornelius. Can I ask one more no, thing? No, 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 you can't ask. Constitutional carry. You constitutional carry. Mr. Mr. Cornelius. Okay. All right. I just wanted to know where you stood on constitutional carry. I'm just trying carry. to help you out. You gotta accept help sometimes, Mr. Wall. I'm trying to help you out. Well, I was just asking if you, you said okay. not for defunding Ms. The, Cornelius. the police and everything. Remember I want the citizens to be armed to the teeth. <laughs> okay. All right. Uh, let's see. Next, we have. Uh, I'm going to call upon this. I'm going to get off the agenda for just a second here and ask Mr. Washington has got. Uh, You're not armed right now. Are you? No, I, I'm a convicted felon, so I can't. Yeah. Mr. Washington has got some comments that he wants to make on the upcoming youth crusade. 